Welcome to the Process and Energy Laboratory in the Graduate School of Energy Science at Kyoto University. I'm Dr. Iwao Kawayama, who presides over this laboratory. We are engaged in cutting-edge research on innovative energy devices using state-of-the-art simple fabrication processes and characterization techniques. Let me introduce some of the research we are doing now. Our lab is working on developing high-performance and practical storage batteries. To make a storage battery, we need to stack different layers of materials together. We made it possible to use materials that couldn't be combined before by using advanced thin film technology. This allows us to stack materials with different properties and structures. Using such thin film technology, we are challenged to fabricate batteries with much higher energy density than conventional batteries, as well as ultra-compact batteries that can be integrated with semiconductor devices. Our other primary research focus is evaluating materials and devices using terahertz waves. Terahertz waves are electromagnetic waves with a frequency around 1 terahertz or between radio waves and light. Although terahertz waves are still rarely used in practical applications, recent research has shown them to be very useful in various fields, including medicine, telecommunications, and materials science. I am Dr. Manza and uh, I uh, also work in this lab. And here we use the terahertz waves to measure the property of energy materials and devices such as storage batteries, solar cells, and semiconductor devices. By using terahertz waves, we can measure how electrons and ions move in a trillion of a second time scale. The combination of terahertz waves and laser light also allows us to obtain information not only on the surfaces, but also inside the materials in a non-contact manner. In this way, in our lab, we can handle the entire process from design to synthesis and evaluation. We are looking for students who are eager to actively participate in hands-on experimentation through trial and error. 